exercise three, solving for V naught given the launch angle delta Y and delta X. Here you can use the displacement equation for both the X and Y components, make an expression for V naught T using the X component, and substitute that expression into the Y component's displacement equation. I have done an actual example for you. We are given delta Y equals 6, delta X equals 15, and theta equals 22. Using the displacement equation and the X component of displacement, I have 15 equals V naught cosine 22 times T. Now I will solve for V naught T. V naught T equals 15 divided by cosine 22. I'll take that value and substitute it into the displacement equation in the y direction. The displacement equation in the y direction will be 6 equals v naught sine 22 times t minus 1 half gt squared. Substituting my value for v naught t gives me 6 equals sine 22 times 15 divided by cos 22 minus 1 half gt squared. Simplifying gives me 6 equals tangent 22 times 15 minus 1 half gt squared. Now it's a simple matter to do the algebra and solve for t.